Okay, okay right so um, you just have to be careful. <laughs> just what is this? so Mr. Cage poured all his students into nothing. Yeah, well, that's Mr. K. He's s such a thrill seeker. <laughs> okay, so this is a yttrium barium copper oxide superconductor. So type two superconductor. It's uh, critical temperature is about 92 degrees Kelvin. Whoa. Now, one of the things with these is that they're fragile and you shouldn't really touch them with your hands because um, there's moisture in your hands. So you've got to keep them dry to help them last a long time. So just to prove to you that the Meissner effect is not due to Lenz's law and that it is the actual expulsion of the magnetic fields from the superconductor. What I'm going to do with this permanent magnet is I'm going to place it on top of the superconductor. Okay, so it's just on top of the superconductor. It's not levitating. It's not doing anything. It's not moving. Okay. Now, what I have here is um, liquid nitrogen. Just be it will boil off pretty rapidly at first until it cools down the superconductor so it will spit and so on so just sort of keep your eyes back please and it'll take as it boils off it will cool down now just watch what happens. Can everyone see? So it's cooling it down. So it's levitating. If it if it if it was pushed up, there's no I didn't there's no magic involved. I didn't touch it. So as you can see, whoops. Oh, that is Holy nuts. Okay, so the magnetic field has to be, the magnetic lines of flux need to go from the North Pole to the South Pole. Okay. As opposed to other forms of magnetic levitation, say with permanent magnets or electromagnets, superconductors are a little bit cooler because, you know, I can move this around. As long as it's above the superconductor, it's not going to slip off the side too easily. Obviously, if I push it enough over to the edge, it'll go off to the side, okay? But um, it, it pins it, okay? So it's, it's a much better form of magnetic levitation than with other types. So, see it's spinning around it's, and it doesn't feel any urge to dive off to the side or find gravity. It's just levitating. So it's fully karmic. You should watch this for the whole lesson. That would be awesome.